Hi everyone, Dr. Sturm here. Congratulations on again a great week, week number six. Very impressed with all the students again as we're staying in school. We know that there has been a lot of challenges lately as there's a lot of external things happening, but we're maintaining with our school, maintaining with our learning, and we're so happy about that. A few things you should know. Um, we are looking forward to an interview today with Ms. Kelly Hargraves-Cox, who is one of our new teachers in learning support. We're also looking forward to our uh, parents' coffee evening tomorrow evening, and we'll post the um, recording of that on Friday when we post this message. So if you can't join, you'll be able to get the recording and be able to see everything that happens then. So again, thank you very much. Congratulations on a great week. All the best, Dr. Sturm. So hello everyone. So after our wonderful introduction from Dr. Sturm, I would like you to meet Ms. Hargreaves. She's our new learning and support teacher and I'm going to be interviewing her today. So first off, hi Ms. Hargreaves. I just wanna ask you, why did you decide to come to ISP? Um, I came to ISP based on two reasons. One, because it's closer um, to your, in Europe, to my family, so I'm from England originally. Um, and I've been living in Asia for the past seven years, so it's nice to be back on this side of the world. Um, and also because of ISP's reputation, um, I was really interested in being a school that's progressive and really interested in being here in an international community. And could you tell us some more about why you decided to become a teacher? Um, I wanted to be a teacher from a really young age, when I was little, maybe when I was six or seven. I wanted to be a teacher because I thought the holidays would be really good. Um, and obviously, that's still true now, but at the same time, maybe when I was younger, I didn't realise all the hard work. But when I was growing up, um, I was really interested in how the teachers supported me and how that made me want to be um, as an adult, so I kind of wanted to become a teacher because I was really interested in empowering young people. Like I had been empowered by my teachers. Wow. And so what do you hope to bring to ISP in this spirit that you just talked about, that you, how your teachers really uh, empowered you and really motivated you? What do you hope to bring here to ISP? Um, so those kind of things are really important to me. So empowerment of young people, especially young people who have learning needs or learning challenges. Here in the learning support department, we empower those young people, we inspire them, we help them find strategies to help them develop their skills so that they can achieve what it is that they want to become when they, they grow up. Awesome. And do you have any cool outside of school activities that you're really passionate about? Um, yeah, so when I trained to be a learning support teacher, I also trained at the same time um, to be an art teacher. And um, so my first school, I was an art teacher for students with wow. um, very severe learning support needs. Um, so I'm very passionate about art and creativity. Um, so I still um, examine for the IB for visual arts. Um, I have lots of artistic things on my desk. So um, I like to make things, I like to design things. Um, so lots of crafts and um, arty things outside of school. Okay, well, thank you so much for your time and your uh, wonderful answers to our questions, and I hope to be seeing you around yeah, at the Lounge School. So, thank you guys for watching. Bye. Thank you.